the area room where it tends to lag a bit in here because of uh, just there being water all over the floor. And it's like slowing down here and that. I just killed like three of them at once with a freaking throw. I can't throw anymore. Can you heal? I'm looking. Need support? Yes. Oh shit, I can't revive you while I'm reloading. Can you get someone? Because I can't revive you until. Damn it. No, I was re. I had to reload my gun. Because I was reloading too, and while I'm reloading, I can't do the revive animation while reloading. Oh, don't worry, I cleared out everyone with a uh, couple of well placed rockets. I killed myself with a rocket, never mind. And now I'm out of ammo. Uh, I want nothing but a sniper rifle to try and kill this guy from long range. Yeah, I'm coming. Whether or not I make it there on time is a totally different story. Yeah, you're not gonna make it. I accidentally rocketed myself, and then my second rocket, which was my last one, I hit the barricade that he was standing in front of, and it did no damage to him. Which is fucking amazing. Because apparently explosive damage in this game does not fucking transfer through materials. Which is stupid. Like, even if the head's above it, you have to hit him in the head to get any damage on him. However, the electric fence is down I'm closer to it now, so I don't care. It's not like the fee for dying is that big anyway. It's only like 150 or something like that. I think I have to pay like 400-ish. Oh, wow. That's not that much. Oh, sweet. Got some more rockets in his chest. And a rocket launcher. Uh, you need an electric rocket launcher? Don't really need one. Well, I'll pick it up and bring it over there anyway. I'm okay, so where's this electric fence? Uh, I just looted it. Oh, okay. Remember that electric fence that was like in front of like this little area? When we first not, re here? not really. <laughs> of course, you and your short-term memory loss. Uh, that's a spike shield, why not? Just loot everything. There's probably an echo somewhere in here. You check that back room, I'll check this room. Actually, I don't think there is, but I'll check anyway. Obviously, can't get up here. Up where? Not on top of the shack, I tried. Yeah, there's Can't. a shack in here too that I thought you could get up on when I first played, but I don't think you can get to the very top, but they managed to glitch our way up pretty high on it, and uh, there was nothing up there, so. Mm. Oh, there's a really good secret in this room, though. And watch out for suicide cycles and stuff in this room. Because this is like the last area. Another present for my sweet <laughs> Uh, they're all dead. There's only three. Oh. So you see all these, like, locked cells oh. in that? Like, before, yeah. you, before you move up too much, because you'll trigger the cutscene if you move up too much. But you see, like, this locked cell here and all these ones? Good secret here. Climb up this ladder. This is also where the first vault symbol of this area is. Actually, I'm going too far. Well, you can keep going that way and just get the loot chest that's around the corner. Anything good in there? Uh, inspiring sniper rifle at 118 and 95, and a smooth sniper at 105 and 93. What's the ammo capacity? So, 8 and 9. Uh, I'd rather have the fire sniper. So yeah, join me across this thing here when you're done. We'll get the vault symbol. It's right on the back wall. And now to open all the cells, you just flip every single one of these green switches. And all of the cells should be open. Something I would have completely missed if I hadn't found that ladder. They don't all have something in them, but... They're cells. Ammo on a dead guy. 
Yeah, this one has the same. The loot chest is over here. Ooh. Let's see what's in it. Um, is that better fire sniper? It is. Mine. You need it? Uh, let me switch weapons to my sniper. This is better than mine. Well, how good's your current sniper? 101 and 95. That's 110 and 95. I have 93 and 95, so I think I'm getting this one. Yeah, you get that one. That is lovely. Which I was full on ammo, so I have to drop my old sniper. Drop my old sniper, it's on the ground there. It's a blue weapon. It's got, like, a really good zoom in. And that's about it. Nothing really else to say about that sniper. Pick it up. I don't know if I'm ever going to use it, but fuck. Yeah, probably not. I can just sell it. It's probably worth quite a bit of money. I think it said it was like 160 or some shit. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna drop that 1300 damage bazooka too. Just so I can pick up some of these. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna mess around with my weapons. Okay. Well, I dropped that bazooka. It's, it's by a chest there on the ground, so. If you can want that better bazooka, you can go ahead and take it. Activate the respawns and yeah, our quest objective is literally like 10 feet in front of you, so check that bazooka and we'll go and rescue Roland. What's best to have a sniper for this part or what? Uh, actually, fire weapons are going to be useless for this next part. So. If you have any fire weapons on you, switch them out for something else. Because this is the point in the game where fire weapons aren't that great. Okay. Yeah, check that bazooka back there that I dropped. Should be to the left of the chest. If it's better than yours, you can have it. It is better than mine in every single way. Yeah, I looted that from here. Okay, sweet. I'll go rescue Roland then? Yeah. Uh, some ammo. And cutscene. Vault Hunter. Good to finally meet you in person. Hell of a job fighting through those blood shots. This will just take a second. Yeah, you just fucking shoulder tackle the robot. Yep. Well, that's that. Now let's see about getting out of here. Vault Hunter! You gotta stop this thing! Oh, by the way, back away from the cell, because there's going to be an explosion. And we're good. And watch out for robots. They're everywhere. And the ones that are called exploders, they explode, so... Don't let them explode on you. Like that one. That uh, one beside you. Whoa! Yeah, this is where the game gets hard. Holy fuck. We're gonna be playing this shit for most of the rest of the game, so enjoy. If you hit them in the balls, that's your weak spot. Uh, weak spots are at their joints and their eye. Oh. I was getting like criticals like a... Mother yeah, leg joints. Which reminds me, I think we missed a log back there. I'm just gonna run back and get it. You can keep pressing forward. There's one before you enter the area, too, so don't leave without it. I'm just gonna run back and get that one log that I'm pretty sure we missed. 
Unless you picked it up, but I don't think you did. I know there's one in this room. There was a log on a chair that I got. Yeah, it was way back when, wasn't it? A couple of rooms ago. Okay. Oh, fuck. Because I know for a fact there is one, like, where, like, the cells are. I'm 90% sure I remember getting it. And I don't feel like checking my stuff to make sure. Unless I did grab it and for game, but I don't think I got it. I was pretty sure it was in here. Uh, you know what? Well, I know I got one somewhere. I'm not really sure where it was, but I got one. Yeah, I know you got one on the chair. Oh, whatever. Maybe I picked it up and forgot about it. Nah, I got the straggler. Ah, uh, don't, don't worry about it. If you ever do a second playthrough of this game on your own time, then you can find it then. And yeah, there's gonna be, like, a place we can sell shit to in this next area, so... We'll be taking advantage of that. Yeah, we did miss one. Whatever. We did get five, though. Before you move up too far in this area, just use the shops first. Oh yeah, cutscene. This is the area we're going through. Enjoy. Hmm. There is a vault symbol in here too. I know the general area where it's at, but I can't remember exactly. Oh boy. Oh, by the way, there's random car keys in this place that you can find. While I was playing with my air character, I went out and found them all. It took me like an hour and a half. Because there's no, like... It's all like the echoes where there's at least a white marker showing you where they are. There is no marker whatsoever for these car keys. So I just got to remember where they are from memory. Which one's right here? Yeah, just like check like the cars, like the car doors and that. Just look for car keys, like in the like, car locks and that. Because that's where they'll be. However, we'll go through robots first, and then we'll do with car keys. Because there's like three of them or, or so in this just opening area. And the last one's at the end of the area. You don't have to worry about these bloodshot guys here either. They won't attack us. So you can literally just ignore them or you can kill them for the extra points in that if you really want. Hmm. I just realized I didn't sell any of my guns, so. I'm going to have to use the store soon. Give me a second while I look for those car keys. I know there's, like, at least one more out here somewhere. I don't think it's on this bus, so... Oh, fuck. These guys can run. Uh, yeah, the Exploders, they will chase you down. Okay, I got the second car key. Give me a second while I sell some stuff at the shop, because I'm dumb and didn't do that, so... 
Because we've got quite a bit of area to fight through. By the way, that yeah. room with like all the cars piled up against the walls and shit. There's a car key somewhere in there in one of the cars. Good luck finding it, but it's in there somewhere. Like I said, there's, okay. there's no way to find it without just knowing what you're looking for, so. <laughs> Matter of fact, I forget the kind of parkour to get to it, so enjoy. And it'll be inside like a door? Yeah, it'll key. be like where like the key locks for car doors are, I'm pretty sure, in that room. Or it'll be in like the trunk lock or something, but for that room, I'm pretty sure it'd just be like in a door. Let's see. I have a skin customization. That would probably be why my inventory is so full. Or one of the reasons. Oh, fuck. Exploder, you asshole. Yeah. Uh, watch those. We still haven't found that. I know exactly where it is, so I'll find it for you and just to show you what they look like. I already got two of them in the beginning area. The fourth slot will be till like a little over halfway through this area, and the fifth is like at the very end on one of like the ten cars. You're in the right corner to find it, I'll tell you that much. Except it's up here. It's actually. You can kind of see it from here, actually, if I zoom in. See this car door up here? It's literally right in there. Well, you're on top of this building. That's why you can't get in here. Oh no, I parkoured up onto this spot. Oh, uh, go backwards and there's a chest by that giant Marcus statue. A giant Marcus statue? The one that makes him look like fucking Buddha. Oh, that one. Oh yeah, I was heading that way. Fuck there's a chest up there. Oh. Enjoy. I just jumped on? way past I where I wanted to be. I'm still for a response from my Rubberized Tulsa. Uh, uh, Teslas are pretty good. Oh, We're gonna need him to take All down right, a boss with shield. Coming up, because this boss is a bitch to kill. Lob mirror bend rubberized fire burst. Um, I think I'm gonna take the Tesla because it's better than the one I have. Okay. Um, I'm gonna stick with my mirror. I think I'm gonna take the burst too, and I'm not sure how good that Merv is, but we'll find out. I think he just tossed, tossed a grenade at me. He probably did. These robots toss grenades for left arm and shoot the right or something like that. I don't know. I'm terrible at. Yeah, they do shoot the right. I'm correct on that. Literally, the best thing you can do with these robots is just take them out as grenade them. as possible. Area of effect attacks and such. There's an explorer right on the ass. And the thing about explorers is it's actually better just to let them get close enough to you to initiate detonation and then run away. Because you can outrun them once they stop to start detonating. But if they're right next to you and you blow them up, they'll still hurt you. Because they just automatically detonate. Like the second you kill them, so. Oh shit, I switched for a carbine. Uh. Yeah, you do your inventory management now. Yeah, done it. Okay. Which, by the way, I honestly thought there was something up like this way at first when I first came through this area. You see where I am now? Um, I see you on my mini map. Yeah, you're going the wrong way, but whatever. Yeah, I know. That guy just got spurred into a, into a pit. I can't kill these marauders. Oh yeah, that's because they're cutscene immune. So when you move up, there'll be a cutscene that initiates where they'll die. That's why you're not dying. Just move up a little bit more and the cutscene will initiate. Dude, these guys have fucking plasma beam cannons. Oh yeah, when you shoot off their arms, they use their ultimate attack. It's very annoying. It's 
Especially considering like their crit spots for sniper rifles are their arm joints, and if you pull their arms off, then they, or at least their shooting arm, they will just use nothing but their plasma beam. And if they hit you a bit, it hurts quite a bit. Like I said, robots are like the worst to fight. Which, the fourth car key is in that car balancing on the ledge up there. I'm going to go grab it. Right in the trunk. Which we're getting closer to where the vault symbol is, I'm pretty sure, as well. It's actually not super well hidden, so. The moon is shooting fucking laser beams at us. Uh, that's the Hyperion dropship. That's parked in front of the moon, in case you haven't noticed. Uh, we have a war loader. And an explorer after my ass. I just got down by the warlord. Send help. I need more ammo. Shit, I have no ammo. I stole your kill because I needed the second win. Fucker. I'm here. Kill me. I am. Uh, we might have surveyors flying in the air. Which they're the most annoying things in the game to freaking shoot. A uh, warlord. I can't bubble him, so. I tossed the nade. Actually, I can't bubble him. I just missed the first time. Arm joints. Hey. This is weak spot. Arm joints. Him and the arm joints are good. Or the eye. Either one. All robots have the same weak points. Yeah, I think we're close to a vault symbol here. Uh, this is... Double tap rifle. Uh, a bunch of shit. Yeah. Vault symbol, I th think, is... Get right here. Well, you can't get extra down, but... Come over here and get the vault symbol. It's right under this ramp on the wall. It's not that well hidden, but... It, it took me a while to find it, because it's just... Not well hidden, you'd think it wouldn't be there. Got some guys up here. I'm just gonna kill him to get the red doll off my map. Is this gonna throw me off otherwise? Whoa! Oh, okay, it's just iridium. 